Alrighty, we are driving through what I would call the hill country of Tennessee, just outside. Just, oh, she's going to tell us where to go. Just outside of, uh, just north of Chattanooga. It's really beautiful, beautiful country here. I just have to say, though, the sky's been really rough. Those of you that know what I'm talking about know what I'm talking about. Oh, I gotta go left. The drive so far has been a little bit, it, while it's been absolutely beautiful uh, country, I mean, Tennessee is just, not only is it just beautiful topography, but the people just really have pride in their lots, their everything. It's just really beautiful. And I'm talking in the country. I'm not talking in the city. I mean, I think in the city, for the most part, you kind of get the same thing every city you go to. Something about the city does that to people. Mm. Ain't nobody got time for that. <laughs> so I was at the, I had to stop at the UPS store the other day and, or it wasn't even the UPS store, it was the UPS customer service in Jacksonville to pick up a package. Would you like more details? Just kidding. And the woman, I told her that I was really worried because when I was driving in, there were just like massive cars driving in. I thought, oh my gosh, everybody's coming in after the holiday to get a package and, um, so I just thought, okay, just relax into it. You'll just be here for a while. And sure enough, they all turned left instead of right. And the customer service was to the right. So when I got in, I told her, I was like, whoo, missed that one. And she said, oh, it wouldn't matter. It wouldn't matter. I'd get you through it in and out the exact same amount of time. <laughs> and I was like, wow, you're good, huh? And she said, she said, yeah, the longer you let people sit around the more they fester then you got trouble and ain't nobody got time for that <laughs> that was hilarious ain't nobody got time for that and as I was walking out I said ain't nobody <laughs> okay back to normal kind of hey friends it's joy I don't know how to get some light Okay, that's better. Hi. This trip has honestly been the um, do what I say, not what I do, because everything I've done on this trip has been wrong. <laughs> I have just, it's just been really costly so far, and it's also been just stupid costly. I mean, yeah, it's really expensive to travel in the U.S. without your own sleeping quarters because I'm not really good at planning how far I'm gonna drive or all that jazz and it's just turned I don't know it's just not been I just got I just drove all day no not really all day but <laughs> look at what I brought in look at that is that nuts or what a lot of that's food and bags but it's ridiculous Harley stuff. I mean, I mean, even when stuff's kind of poopy, I don't know. I just sort of maybe try to. I, I definitely try to learn, but I tend to make a lot of the same mistakes. <laughs> just I just I don't like to plan. I don't like to because I just don't know what I'm gonna feel in the moment. And I know that drives people that are close to me crazy too. Wink, wink. I really don't like to plan. <laughs> I like to really be in. I seriously think I need to go to the wilderness and just live in the wild where there's no calendars and no time frames. It's just what it is. All right, I'm gonna go to bed now. I'm gonna just calm down and go to bed. So, bye bye.
So, okay. I'm not going to say so again. Not again. But 